Okay. Let's see what we get. Definitely something down there. That was a nail, I believe. Maybe not. nail. Must be a lot of All right guys, I got another hit here. Get me a shovel there. See if it's it right here. So it's right here, real close. Try again. Alright, we'll do it up. 
Let's see what it is. Oh, there it is. Where is it? Penny. Nineteen seventy six D. All right, guys, got another hit for the GT. It's out already. Well, that's not too old. 81. Must have been just below the surface. Okay. 1981. Alright, guys, I got another hit here. Did you hear that sound? lock on. Pocket on. Yeah. Hmm. There we go. Pretty deep. Well, that's been the ground for a while. All right. Got another hit here. I won't pick up my ring, but it picked up the There it is. It's a nickel. Nineteen sixty four. Oh my goodness, that's pretty cool. 
That GT really works good. Okay guys, another hit here. Fell back in the hole. Try again. And now. Okay, that's it. There you go, you got a hit in right here. Oh, here it is. Clad. Clad penny. Huh. That's why I was showing junk. All right, I'm going to show you uh, what I found in a short period of time using uh, my son's uh, Coin Master GT. And uh, I got a quarter and copper penny, 81, a little nickel. 1964 76d a couple dimes some nails there's a lot of nails out here in the front yard but uh, this uh, white's uh, GT uh, really works great I might invest in one later on when mine wears out but uh, my son said here try it out see how, how well you do and first time I really got a chance to really use it and this thing really does a good job at pinpointing the coins I'm really impressed with it so that might be my ne next upgrade some days but uh, till next time guys uh, we'll see you take care bye bye